Hello everyone, today on the channel, it's time for Deck Academy, it's Deck Academy, we're gonna build a brand new deck. So we are on a roll with dragons, and what does that mean? That means that the previous couple of weeks I believe we made the dragon decks, yeah we made Raktos dragon and Demir dragons. And we already have mono red alchemy dragons from long, 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 long time ago. <laughs> so today we're gonna build Golgari dragons, which sounds strange, but it is what it is. I mean, there are dragons in black and there are dragons in green. So, oops, type in the wrong thing. Let's see what we have available. So as usually, this has dragon in it. Uh, this thing is good, right? This ramps us into dragon. So we're gonna play four of that guy. And this thing is also good. We're gonna play that. This thing also ramps. We don't mind ramp. This is not that interesting. Uh, this guy searched for dragon, so we're gonna play two of those. This guy, no. Uh, we have one of him, so we're gonna play him. This guy, counter. That could be interesting. Uh, that's also not bad. And we have two old nobons, and we have two earthquake dragons, and we have one Belladros, and... Ah. Oh, this is just green. Where is black? We forgot black. Uh, two these guys, two Junji, one of these guys. Black dragon does not do that much, and there's one gate. Okay, so that seems fine. So besides all this stuff, we need some removal now. So let's go to our trusty alchemy and see what removal we can play. Because we got enough dragons as it is. And we need card draw, so we're gonna play painful bonds. And what just happened? This arena view away. How did we get so many cards? We want to see like less cards actually, not more cards. Okay. Back to our normal view. What is going on with our uh, lighting and internet? What is going on? This thing is useful, isn't it? Seems useful. Just play one. How do we get Kamiyo Morning in there? Uh, do we have something for removal? This guy is not a dragon, he's a demon. Uh, this could be interesting. This could also be interesting. However, we haven't found any remover yet. Oh, this guy is good. He also ramps. So we have poison the blade, which doesn't do anything. If we don't play any removal, we're going to get killed. We're gonna get killed ASAP, especially in alchemy. Play this gate. Is that it? Is there any other chance? No, we have to play remover. We have got to play remover.
Otherwise we will be super dead. So what do we take out? Take out with that. Maybe take out this guy instead of... Uh, this guy is... Maybe interesting. This guy doesn't really fit. So we have to... Play some kind of board wipe. Otherwise we're going to... The high. Die pretty quickly. To small creature decks. Blood on the snow is good. Actually, why don't we just play Blood on the snow? And what else we can consider as removal? Oh, there's Bosejo. We forgot to put Bosejo in. Wither Bloom Command. Oh, Binding of the Old Gods. That's removal and ramp. Okay, so we are in business, as they say. So that guy can go out. So now actually what we need is uh, land. We would like some lands. Because we only got basic lands and bosages. So let's play four pathways, four glades. And two snarls uh, we can play to the Atoras Proofy Ground and one Ta Ta what is it called we always forget Takenuma one Hive wait do you even have basic lands for the snarl we don't play this now. Play two hives and two Takenoma because we have like f six basic lands only. Okay, we have a lot of stuff coming to play top two, not gonna lie. This deck is looking shifty. We definitely don't have enough remover. I think we have enough ramp. I think. So. <coughs> Obviously, this is the first version of this deck, so after we play, we can make some changes. Yes, let's use that. And I think we can call it a day. I mean, it's a mid-range deck. It's heavily mid-range. And by heavily, I mean it's very, 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 very slow so let's go and play as usual we are playing it unranked because we just made a deck every single Monday we make a brand new alchemy deck and every single Monday we play it in unranked because we have to test the deck obviously gotta test the deck so we can't play ranked because we're gonna get probably destroyed if we play ranked. Gonna get destroyed. Gonna get destroyed. So we are in the unranked. Unranked version now. Uh, sure. So in terms of removal, we ended up with just binding, which is going to go out. I mean, September is rotation time. So this rotation, this rotation is going to be big. Actually, do we even have a lot of forest? Because if we don't have a lot of forest, this binding might be useful. I guess we can search for another one. Hold on a second. This thing comes into play. And he ramps. Yeah, we really like this card. We really, really like this card. If you want to ramp, this is the guy you want to ramp with. This is the guy you want to ramp with. And if you discard him, you can get two forests into your hand, which we don't have a lot of forests. So, what is this, though? Exile all cards. Uh, let's get this guy down.
So we are playing against some kind of weird deck. So we only have one of him, we forgot what he does. Oh, he just makes base creatures. Sure. So playing dragons is fun because obviously it's not a normal deck at all. So we can do basically whatever we want. And opponent's probably gonna be confused by what we do. Uh, we don't actually have anything to kill, right? Yeah, that kind of sucks. So we're just gonna cast more of this, I guess, to ramp into Belladros. We haven't drawn any other dragons. We don't have anything to binding of the old gods because the opponent just doesn't want to cast any here. Okay, now we finally got a target. Well, are they playing Rakdos Dragon? Wait, 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 wait a second. We put Blood on the Snow, but we don't have actually... We forgot to put Snowlands. Why are we even attacking with these guys? We got to put uh, Snowlands, so that kind of sucks. But I mean, our stuff is so huge. So huge. Oh, we could have put the gate thing. Anyway, we got more chances. Let's just kill this dragon too. Let's just kill dragons and ramp. We don't have the red orb. Why are you targeting? It doesn't do any damage. We don't have the red orb. The red orb is good. We don't care if we lose life because when we cast a dragon, if we use this, we gain life. The red orb gives them haste, so that's really good. Okay, enough with the lands. Like, why? This is a forest, so that's good to know. Uh, I'm not sure why. He has death touch, but... Doesn't do anything. Just gain the life back. Attack with the death touch guy. Opponent is not gonna block. Yeah, they probably don't wanna lose to the 1-1. One, one. Sure. Although we can probably let it die now. We have enough lands. Yeah, so they're playing Rakdos Dragons because of course, why would they not be playing Rakdos Dragons? Why would they not be doing that? Uh, let's tap this guy and tap this guy to gain more. Draw more dragons. We don't have a remover for Inferno because it didn't draw another binding. But that's fine. They have to block the flying dragon. This thing can just... We can discard and get the thing out of our deck. Yeah, we don't need this anymore, actually, because we have enough lands, I think. Where's our card draw? We have four of those card draw things. Uh, sure, you can take the Kami. Maybe Blood on the Snow is not the best thing to play here. Is there another Boar Wipe that we can possibly play in Golgari? I don't think so. We have to take another look. That's just not useful at all. Let's just use this thing. Yes, that's much better. Uh, attack, attack, attack. We can't play Boseju because we have one already. Sure. Last turn. Well, yeah, we definitely have to see if there's something else. I guess we could play Deadly Dispute too. But we already have the other card that draws us cards.
We have the card that draws us the cards. This is just uh, this is gonna be a weird matchup. Okay, so playing is, is just playing red, red, black, red, black. Good stuff, I guess. It's not even dragons. They just happen to have dragons in the deck. Red, black treasures or something. I don't know. I don't know. Not this guy. If we plot on the snow, it just doesn't do anything. Okay, let's just attack. It's better if we actually blot on the snow when we have Junji out, to be honest. Actually, no, because we only have dragons. Uh, but we can get something from the opponent. Let's drop this. We can also discard this guy to get two forests. To thin out our deck because we got enough lands. Yeah, so either we play the basic lands as snow, snow cover, but it doesn't really work. Yeah, okay. Are you kidding us? This opponent is still alive. Okay, there goes our Junji. Okay, can we draw something? No, we keep throwing lands. Okay, so this game, we don't even have the the man lands. To be honest, I guess we could use Brawn on the snow too, but whatever. Just attack t -Bout with everybody. We do have enough creatures in this deck. We do have some card draw. Maybe we just don't play Blood on the Snow. We play more targeted removal. But then we're gonna get killed by go white decks as usual. Because why wouldn't we? Sure. Why we drew like three of these? Why? Yeah, finally. And why are we drawing like so many lands after we we got rid of like so many other lands? Yeah, we have high casting cost stuff, so it's like it doesn't do anything. Okay, cast this dragon, which you can't even broke Janji. Oh, we could have attacked, and then poison breath, whatever. Ah, whatever. Yes, we don't need any more of this guy. Are you honestly kidding us now? Oh, this is only once per game? Okay, that makes more sense. That makes more sense. Not really, but it makes more sense. Activate only once means like once per game. Uh, pass the turn. This is turning into a very, 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 very bad game. Yeah, blood on the snow, but blood on the snow, what? Okay, that's much better. Pass the turn. Not gonna lie, we're getting there, but we gotta figure out either take blood on the snow out or put snow cover lands in. Not again. Are you kidding us right now? How many T-Balls does the opponent have? They cast like two T-Balls already. Why do they have three in a row? <laughs> sure. You know you're not really supposed to win when the opponent is getting three T-Balls in a row. They can cast Junji, but if they make us discard, it doesn't do anything. 
I think we're just gonna have to blow on the snow t bot. Obviously. Oh, that's not bad. Let's just blow on the snow t bot to get it over with. This guy's three mana. God knows you have enough mana. 10 10, baby. 10 10. Oh, we forgot to tap these guys. Sure. So they can cast Junji, but it doesn't do anything if they may cast this card or hand. If they bring a non dragon card, they can bring something from their graveyard because we only have dragons, I think. Yeah, but this thing comes back, right? He definitely comes back. Sure. Sure. I mean, all they got so far was Junji. Which I don't know why they're not attacking with him because this dragon is a. Uh, uh, discard this case since it doesn't do anything. I mean, sacrifice that deck. Comes back to your hand. Enough with the blood on the snows. Oops, we forgot to tap these guys again. We missed getting six life. Uh, pass the turn. Kind of boring, kind of boring. Not gonna lie, this matchup is not hot. Not hot at all. I'm not sure why we got paired up against this other slow deck. Obviously, if he was angels or something faster, we would we would be dead by now. But at the same time, at least we get to attack with a 10-10. Oh my god, so many lands. Okay. Attack with a 10-10, they can block with Junji and make us discard, I don't know, two lands. Stop wasting our time. And then they can cast the other Junji, which doesn't really matter. We could have attacked with the green dragon too, actually. Come to think of it, because they'll probably have to broke the 10-10 because they die. And they would have taken 4. That was kind of a mistake. Oh, this thing has trample too? Oh, that's ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Uh, what are they going to put? Okay, there's nothing they can take from our hand. Nothing at all. You got nothing. You got nothing on us. Yeah, they basically gave up. They can cast another Junji, but it just tramples over. It tramples over. Okay, so we gotta figure out what to do with Plot on the Snow. I think we might have to play another. We might have to play another board wipe instead of blood on the snow another board wipe is what we are looking for uh, or we could just not play a board wipe just nothing why is red in here? There's literally nothing? Wow, okay. A uh, blood on the snow does kill the planeswalkers though. So in that case we might just have to play Snow covered lands, although we don't have a lot of swamps. 
the two swamps and we have four forests uh, we definitely don't want to have so many bosages and two hive Takinuma is not bad F cup clay maybe play only one hive play one more snow we have 25 lands now Yeah, we remember Blood on the Snow kills Planeswalkers, which would have ruined our life if we didn't get to Blood on the Snow, that T-Bolt. So he's got that going for it. It's a got that going for it. So what are we dealing with now? Kinda not good. This thing adds green mana for anything, okay. So you can technically ramp into Binding of the All Gods. Oh no, we're playing the stupid thing. We are playing the stupid deck. No. Okay, that's not... That is not bad. Uh, let's get another green and get this bad boy down. Yeah, we're gonna miss. We haven't, we haven't played Binding of the All Gods in a Coon's Age because we haven't played Gorgari in a Coon's Age, but we're gonna miss it. We're gonna miss it for sure. I mean, it's such a good card. What is this guy do? Sick land card, okay. Uh, what can we do with 5 mana? Actually, we can't do anything because they both come into play tapped. So that sucks. Faster turn. That really, really, really sucks. Eh? Why everything comes into play tapped? That is the question. What is this? Okay, it's good we have blood on the snow now. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I'm not sure if we're ever gonna get to use the return part. Although we do have 5 casting cost dragons if we get 5 mana. Sure. I think we're gonna have to blow on the snow. Next turn. Most likely. Most likely just blow on the snow and bring this guy back because he's exactly two mana. Ha ha ha. Take that opponent, take that. So we don't lose anything. So we still have like seven mana, so we can drop this bad boy next turn. And then drop this bad boy the turn after. Fortunately they don't have haste. But they are bad. Bad to the bone. Bad. Bad. B -b 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 bad, bad to the bone. How did they rebuild already? They are like two cards in hand. I guess they drew more cards. Anyway, let's drop this bad boy and gain two life. See how they like him. Yeah, that's not gonna do much. And then we drop this bad boy next turn. He's only six mana. Sure. Uh, this guy doesn't trample, right? Okay, we might need to draw another floor on the snow ASAP. Uh, what? What on God's green earth? 
Yeah, we definitely had a blood on the snow. Okay, just block the flyer so we can get a lot of treasures. Sure. Osiju needs to kill that. Let's see if we can cast two dragons. I think we can cast two dragons, cast Junji and then cast this guy. And then hopefully we don't die. We can also gain two life from him. We go down to 14 and we have two blockers, so technically we shouldn't die. Technically. Yeah, cast this dude. And then this is one mana. Wow, we can actually cast this guy too. Because this is only one mana. So we have three blockers. What are you gonna do now, opponent? What are you gonna do now? <coughs> With your little one ones. Oh, that's right. That's right. We can actually deal 29 points of damage. 10, 17, 21, 26. Oh, we can only deal 26. We can only deal 26. Unfortunately. That is pretty funny. That is pretty funny. Yeah, they want to get a blocker. Oh, wait, why didn't we block those guys? We only saw the one one. Okay, that was. That was kind of stupid for us. So next, what do we do? Uh, what do we want to attack with this? This? This makes treasure? Oh wow, we're gonna get like 20 treasures, but we need blockers, right? So let's just attack for 17. Yeah, we should have blocked this one once. I don't know what we were doing. Because are we going to die? If we go to 7, we have 4 blockers. 1, 2, 3, 4. No, we should still be alive. Not if we keep drawing more painful bonds. If we go to 6, 3... Yeah, let's, let's play dangerously. Because we're trying to draw more creatures, obviously, not more lands. Wow, we drew three painful bonds in a row. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, Arena, we drew three painful lands and painful bonds. We couldn't draw one creature, so we're not supposed to win this. What is this? Do? Does this make tokens? Oh, they can gain life. That's fine. I mean, they're still dead. They have to beat us this time. Because we have four blockers and we're a six, right? So we block four things and we take five damage. And it's game over. Yeah, it's game over. Even after we drew the <laughs> crazy pain from one. Okay, let's try to go for our third win. Let's try to go for our th 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 third win. If we can get it, we'll take it. If we can get it, of course. I mean, we haven't played terribly competitive decks. I think we have a little bit too much 
we should play maybe more card draw. We have a little bit too much ramp. That's even possible. We have this too. I think maybe we don't need this. But they do come out early. Everybody else comes out so late. Actually, we don't need this guy. Uh, yeah, play this and then I guess we cast the orb next. Z orb. Oh, now we're playing competitive deck. Okay, this is going to be... It's going to be not fun. Okay, we do need lands though. Yeah, this guy is going to go out for sure. It doesn't do much. And maybe we don't need these guys. And maybe we need more card draw. Yeah, we got to ramp into Blood on the Snow in this situation. Blood on the Snow, we're a 5 mana. Uh, we can get this guy to block and we can search for a dragon. He can block and search for a dragon. Okay, we need a fifth mana for Blood on the Snow. Oh, they don't attack with Voice of the Blessed. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's not Blood on the Snow, but we're gonna get our six mana from this. Because why not? Wait, how did we not kill the 6-6? Six, six? Okay, never mind. He can chump block anyway. Uh, the Dragon, uh, the Angel deck, which we also play. Wait, what? No, 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 this guy can save them from blood on the snow. Okay, that's not good. That's not good now. Hey, we should have killed this instead of the other one. This is just, I don't know why, how they got this suddenly. What dragon do we want that's 5 mana? Uh, take Kura. Yeah, I mean this... Yeah, here we can... We can blow on the snow, but the problem is they have this stupid grief guy and they can suck it and then do we die? Wait, what? No, 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 we didn't want to play Kura, we want to play the land. Yeah, they're just not gonna attack with this guy. We want to play the land and blow on the snow. Yeah, they just have to attack with that guy, but we can actually block. He has death touch, right? Yeah. Did they not notice he has death touch? Uh, yeah, we want lands. They didn't notice he has death touch. Okay, that's pretty good. Get a Boseju. Get a gate. Uh, get a hive. Of course, we top the another land. Of course. Uh, get the hive out and let's make them suck the grief weaver. Grief weaver. Sure. I mean, they still attack us for six. Which is bad. And if we cast Belladros, yeah, we definitely have to take this guy. I think we have to cast Junji. We have to cast Junji. We should have gotten the other big dragon, actually. That's what we should have done. Cast Junji as a 6 6. We don't even have enough mana to cast this guy. Uh. But we can counter their stupid wandering emperor ability. And we can bossage this. Okay, we might have something here. Get to use this. 
Get to use this guy. Yeah, counter. Take that. It's a 5-5 five five now. Junji is a 6-6. Six six. Baby. Yeah, you can level to this. Sure. I think we can actually psych on this. Uh, we have to attack the Wandering Emperor. So... Take her out. Well, they can block with the Angel of Unity, actually. Why do we forget they have Angels? Why would they double block? He doesn't have Trump. Oh, he has Menace. We forgot. forgot he has Menace. Uh, I think the best thing would be to cast him. Sure. And we can bossage you the stupid uh, enchantment. And that's about it. I guess Belladros can make tokens to champ block. And there's not much else to do. Yeah, he's very good at making champ blockers. They can kill our Junji. But can we put something to play? That's not a dragon. Oh no, they exile it. Okay, yeah, that's the problem. That's okay. Uh, they can take, I mean, gain five life. So you have to kill the Wandering Emperor with Belled Rocks. So we need a couple of blockers. <sighs> that is a sweet, sweet deal. That is a sweet deal, not gonna lie. Yeah, we have enough blockers now. So Belledros is going to take her out. Shabam. So now if they don't draw Emperor, uh, let's just play this forget. So this thing actually worked for once in our life. They need an Emperor now. Actually, they don't need an Emperor. I don't know what they need. They pretty much dead. Okay, that's pretty good. Next. Attack in the air. Smash in the face thoroughly. Cast another big boy dragon. Pass the turn. Make more pests. I'm pretty sure they don't have board wipes, so they need emperor. It's game over. So undefeated with Golgari Dragons. Wow. There you have it. Golgari Dragons for the win. So thank you for watching. Please click like and subscribe, of course, for more MTG content videos.